Yo, you guys, I literally just got done saying in my last video I was uploading that the word quarantine, like what people did during quarantine, you'd be real surprised at the kind of trouble they got themselves caught up in, and then look what popped up, quarantine again. So that's what happened. There's a lot of people who thought that during quarantine, um, that they were, it's like you either worked on yourself or you got into deeper shit. <laughs> that's basically what it was, right? Like you had people who realized, oh my God, let me spend this time to myself because I feel like I need to make some changes. And then you had, you had people who were around people that they didn't spend a lot of time with and they got to see the true colors of other people. Um, yeah, it, it got real deep, but there's a lot of people who thought because of the mask thing that they were going to be able to get away with a lot of stuff. And I actually said this to Brian. I said, wait do you see all the things they do illegally because of the mask. Wait do you see all the fraud that happens because now people are wearing masks and they're posing as other people. There are some people who showed up uh, at, on to court uh, as other people, okay? Uh, married people without them even knowing. Cora and trust, yeah. So it was basically like uh, characters being tested and most people failed. I'm just going to be honest. Most of the people failed with what they did with their time during quarantine. And now, I don't know, man. Tell me more. What, what do you want to talk about today? What do you want to talk about right now? Tell me what's up. Haborum. 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 Bore. Borum. They could have been bored. Like I said, it just sitting there and being bored. Um... You know, they had to keep getting into stuff. And it's just it's bad shit. Let's see. Haborum. Beware of sharp wit and cunning becoming a destructive force, if not tempered with consideration. Cunning. Uh, being sly, being manipulative with your words. Let's see who this is. So that, that's somebody right now. Grind it out. Grind it out. Let's see. Tell me about this cunning person. Yeah, somebody that's like, I don't know, man. This is somebody who, uh, they always have a story. This is always a, yeah, I'm, oh, man, I would pay, but some, oh, man, where's my wallet? This is like that person. Somebody that's very manipulative. They're very unstable. The way that they speak, they're, there's not, I don't feel confident. Simple, it's a very simple person. Yeah, Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this is this is something's coming back to this person. Truth. Yeah, something's about how um, she betrayed you, or there's something coming back to this person because uh, the words that they use, they could have lied on you. I don't know. The video. There could have been something on video or something like that, or this person could make videos too. Something's coming back to, to bite someone in the ass. Storyteller, yep. Making up tales that harm others. This is somebody who told a lot of lies on another person, man. On a chosen one. On someone that's royalty. Yep. A child of the universe. Look, this could even be their own child, man. This could be somebody that's just very manipulative with her own children. S swell. She could have swelling somewhere or something could be beginning to swell. Your enemy is angry because they have to watch you all day. So whoever this person is, okay, uh, you could have a platform. This person has gray hair possibly, but tell me more. Signed a contract and now they can't get out of it. Signed a contract with who? some of these signed a contract and oh this could be a mom who knew that the best thing to come so something great is coming for you out of this I really feel like somebody's very very like slick with their words and people believe this person that they do have gray hair it could be the type of person where it's like well they're old so why would they lie right but they're a liar they're just very manipulative with their words, their emotions. They're real good at making you feel small. This is the type of person that, that uh, rallies up minions to go against a person. And they'll even, they'll even turn people against. Like They're very good at turning people against another person if they're jealous or something. MHD.
parents' mental health. Is that what this, a mental health disorder, MHD? So this person's got an issue. They could have said that you did. Yeah, so they were trying to make people think that another person had health issues, like mentally they were crazy or something like that, but something's coming back. This person is actually crazy. This is somebody who projects what they really what they are onto other people. Unit. You could have like a tight unit with somebody. Unite. It could be oh slower. Unit slower. No goals. So whoever this is, they're just kind of like I don't know. They just kind of show up in life barely in February. So this is happening now that it's coming back to somebody. Your neighbor, for some of you it's your neighbor. Hold on a second. Exposing a sex trafficking ring, uh oh. <laughs> so there are some people who possibly thought that you were crazy because you said you were, if you're exposing a sex trafficking ring, somebody could have thought you were nuts. And I feel like now something's coming back to this person. Maybe there's people, listen, maybe you're this queen of swords and you're very good with your words, okay? And this is your story with the storyteller. People may have been kind of on the fence as to whether this was truly happening or not. They could have thought you were nuts. But there's somebody here who signed a contract with this uh, trafficking ring here. Yeah. Cancer saves the day, so you could be someone. You could be saving the day, or you've saved people. I feel like you've saved people. You've warned people. A little over jealous. That's what it is. I feel like there's people who are like I want to get the recognition for doing this. I want people to look at me and say, "Oh my God!" Like she's I saved people, or you know what I mean? That I feel like people are jealous. Because they don't have any goals, and your goal is to expose these trafficking rings. Like, you don't care what it does. You don't care what you have to give up. Like, you actually do this because you want to do it. This person with the signed a contract could actually be somebody that signed a contract with, like, the gang stalk or something. And now it's like, okay, so that's what you wanted to do. And now the person that they're gang stalking is actually saving kids and saving people from being trafficked. Yeah, and they, it's like, well, mm, they didn't want to believe it. Like, they really, it was easier for somebody. I do feel like for someone, it's an air sign. But it could just be just somebody who was real good at trying to make people around you think that you were crazy. And now, now it, I feel like it's coming out that there was a trafficking ring. Or it's about to come out that there was a trafficking ring in your neighborhood. This could be somebody who's connected to a, someone you're in a relationship with or you're friends with. Like you, I don't know, what is this? Yeah, Look, all these people working together, this is what somebody does for work. So someone that didn't want to believe, no, mm -mm. nope. This could even be like some police officers or something, you know, nope, don't want to believe it. Believe what, that what these people do for work, it's like insurance scams, life insurance. Money, this is like, you know, trafficking in your community. Yeah, and now it's like these people have no choice but to walk away from trying to make you look crazy because they're starting to look crazy. And I don't think people knew how rampant it was. Hill? I don't know what that's... Tell me more. Aggressive. This person's aggressive. Or they could think you're aggressive. Tell me more. Thank you. Oh, a Scorpio? What's, what's with this Scorpio? A, there's a Scorpio here that's a career klepto. Don't even fight it. Just go home. So with the hill, I feel like you keep going uphill. These people keep going downhill. And the reason why they're mad and they're cunning with their words and they, they lied and tell stories about you is because you actually are making a difference in this world. And these people are making a difference. The contract that I feel like, I really do feel like it's gang stalking. Like I would be humiliated with myself. Okay. Why can't I have a negative effect on you? Because my focus is what? Exposing this trafficking ring so I can save kids, possibly your kids. 
possibly you. It's like the, the balls on some people to sit there and say things about somebody who's exposing a trafficking ring, but you could have been their next victim, you know? Like these people are probably learning how to protect themselves and what's really going on at the same time they were pointing fingers. Yeah, grace, like, I don't know, you could have grace and stuff or you're just, I don't know, man. It, it just... Be careful, man, because this per this person who's exposing this shit, like, they could wind up saving your life with the information. Who, who's marrying men to use them for money? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or this Scorpio does, man. Don't trust them in your circle. So, depending on who's listening, there's somebody in your circle. Love and light my ass. They're a drug dealer. Scorpio. I don't know. I just feel like uh, because they don't really talk about trafficking a lot on the news, you know, like you really have to go on YouTube and find videos, but it's everywhere that really there's a lot, a lot of people who recognize or realize it was going on everywhere around them. What's up with that basketball? Again, that's twice that that came out in basketball. That must be relevant. That came out last time when I was getting done uploading and I stopped the video. Basketball came out. Is basketball relevant? Yeah, I can't choose. Oh, there could be a basketball court around you where maybe it's not safe. Like, you could be warning people, like, don't let your kids play basketball at night and don't be watching them. Like, I don't know. I just feel like somebody's warning people and there's other people who are mad that somebody's save, helping save people or bring awareness to trafficking. Somebody could have been taking while, while playing basketball. There... There could literally be a situation where whoever was mocking the person exposing the trafficking ring, they could have actually had their child, or this is about to happen, and I don't hope so, but this would be a way where, like, if you were saying somebody was crazy because they were exposing this stuff, and you have a child, and you wanted to make somebody out to be crazy, your child may wind up. Look, listening through your walls, what else is new? I mean, the... <laughs> If they don't listen, I feel like something's wrong. Or the one that got away. So you got away from whatever this is. This could even be people um, around you that were involved in this trafficking stuff. They may not even realize that they signed, that the people that they were connected to was actually in this. I feel like some of these people didn't realize that these gangs and this stuff that they got connected to were attached to trafficking. I want to hope so. So you're the one that got away from not... Because they probably had a target on you. I feel like there's some people who thought that you were just a target for gang stalking. But um, they didn't realize that you were actually a target for something bigger. And that this is why you were doing what you were doing. Been trying to hold you back. It's impossible. Who's this? Yeah, look. You're a targeted individual. A.K.A. Star. There's no targets here. It's, what, what you are is you're, you're, you're somebody that a group of people can't make a move without you making a move. So basically, you become like their boss. Yeah, that's what it is. If you can't make a move until we make a move, then somehow we have power and control over you. And that's just how it goes. Look, have lunch with demons, slay demons. That's what you do. That's what they, they don't recognize that. They don't want to see it that way, you know. Um, when I wake up in the morning, the first thing I do is... I care about myself I don't, I don't care about what somebody else is doing when that's the first thing that you do you are one of the biggest fans of that person it's like when people are obsessed with like jay-z or beyonce and it's the first thing that they think of or whatever that's how these people are with you they don't they don't understand it's an obsession how many more please rahavar rahavar what is this Focus on seeing past the harsh armor of age and experience. Many sharp or grumpy individuals are simply harsh because life has taught them to expect the worst of others. This could be you. People couldn't think that you're like this, but they don't know what you've been through. They couldn't handle what you've been through. Brooklyn, that could mean something. You could be from Brooklyn, live in Brooklyn, or you know, some people around you could be from there. Whatever it is, they don't know what you've been through. They judge you just based off what they saw. Judas. 
on that heel so I freak out in the comments. So you could have a platform and somebody freaks out in the comments if you have your comments open. What is this? Past life. Yep, this is a Judas from your past life for somebody, like a big time one. Let me find out. Uh, are there many? Tell me more about this, please. Yeah, something, someone who was trying to get you caught up and trip you up in a past life. This, there's also some spell work, magic going back to some people, and it's causing a lot of friggin' cuckoo, cuckoo. Yeah, now people are arguing with each other, or uh, it's like mental conflict, like um, that mental health. What was it? Yeah mental health disability or something like that a white car so whoever has a white car is your judas from a past life let me get some uh let me get three letters i'm going to close this out where are we at 16 yeah i kind of want to make them shorter now because i feel like you guys like shorter videos I just get three letters E. This could be a first or last initial. E E. Damn. E E M. Let's see what E E M is. Energy efficient mortgage. I don't feel like that's it. Hold on a second. E E M. The most recent interglacial period of the what? Oh, it means him. So it's a male. Persuade. This person was, oh, a Quran? Somebody may have been trying to persuade people to look at you a different way. Or this could even be somebody from your past life that was able to persuade you to go somewhere and set you up to be kidnapped or trafficked in another lifetime. So this is another one that you slayed. This is another past life entity that was working through people to try to stop you in this lifetime that you slayed. That's all we do around him. We're not going nowhere. <laughs>